Hello everyone, I uh, just want to showcase a quick demo that I've put together featuring the CC3200 Wi-Fi Launchpad from Texas Instruments uh, paired with this uh, SPI based Sharp LCD display. So this is a booster pack that plugs right on top of the Launchpad. Um, and as you can see you've got a really nice 96 by 96 pixel um, LCD module here. So uh, the demo that I've got going on here is I've got the Wi-Fi Launchpad connecting to the cloud to get the latest weather information for any location you want to query. Uh, so in this case, I'm uh, querying a specific zip code. This is my local zip code, 75013. Um, and I'm displaying here the, uh, the current date, um, the forecast, in this case it's sunny, as well as the low and high temperatures. Uh, here you can see it's 41 to 58 degrees, um, along with the uh, current temperature of 61 degrees Fahrenheit. Um, so in this case, uh, this is checking the internet or the cloud every 30 minutes to get the latest temperature data coming from uh, various web services. So to make this work, uh, we're using Energia to program the launchpad, um, but we're using Tembu, which is a cloud service that can actually generate Energia code to enable connected launchpads to interact with hundreds of cloud websites, services, and APIs. Um, so to, to demonstrate a little bit um, additional functionality that I've added, um, let me pull up my cell phone here. And on my cell phone, I have the ability of texting my phone a new location to query. So all I have to do is type in the keyword weather, put in a dash, and then the desired location. So let's try Chicago, Illinois. So there you go, you can see that I've got whether the keyword Chicago, Illinois is a desired location. I'm going to go ahead and hit send. So this is going to ping a cloud service called Twilio. Um, and Twilio is going to capture that text message and I'll be able to use a REST API to find the latest um, text message that has that keyword weather. Then using Energia, I'm going to parse that uh, message and I'll be able to uh, figure out the desired location. And again, this is all being done using uh, Tembu, which has the ability of generating code to enable our launchpad to interact with cloud services such as Twilio. So now that uh, that information has been sent, let me change focus back to the launchpad. I'm going to go ahead and hit reset. So again, this is pulling information for uh, Dallas, Texas. I want to hit the reset button here on the launchpad. Uh, we'll see a few things here. It's going to try to reestablish connection to Wi-Fi. Um, once it connects to my local Wi-Fi network here at home, it's going to start interacting with Tembu. It's going to start querying Twilio to figure out my desired location. There you go. Uh, you can see that status update there. And once it figures out the desired location, it's going to query uh, the, the weather information. And you can see now Chicago, Illinois is the desired location. You got the date. We see the forecast of mostly sunny as well as the low and high temperature. And then finally the uh, current temperature for the location. Um, so that's really the, the demo I wanted to show here today. Again, this is using the TI Launchpad Development Kits. Uh, we're using Energia, which is our open source wiring-based uh, code development environment. Um, and we're using various cloud services, including Tembu and Twilio, for interacting with um, the, the cloud. Uh, so thanks for watching. You can learn more about this um, at the Energia blog at energia.nu blog. So thanks for watching.